on a minute. Hang on a minute. Well, if you guys didn't have the big swords hanging off the side of your head, I wouldn't have to lock you out to go put out coops. Goodness. We are going to get out of the trees, though, because we got a storm coming. So hang on a minute. Morning, everybody. Chad, Doss Farms. Woo. If you're new here, welcome and howdy. If you're old here, welcome and howdy. This is my lovely wife and I's 40 acres in Northeast Oklahoma, where we raised some cattle, some donkeys, a pig, and a chicken, and three beautiful boys, and three ornery spoiled dogs. That's right. about y'all maybe this is kind of selfish of me but i love watching these cows come through the trees but i gotta lock them out in order to do it because when they see the side by side they come running Whew. all right big old circle of two bags of cubes probably three or four hundred feet long i don't know if you can see this no you can't you see it on the window Ooh, look at that we got rain coming for like the next five days, man. I'm so excited. We also woke up yesterday morning and hang on, clear my notifications here. It's 70 degrees right now and it's 10 a.m. Two days ago at 10 a.m. It was like 97 degrees already. So no complaints, man. All right, let's go get the land hippos. I love this little path right here. You get to see my Charlie Brown Christmas trees. There's another one. That's not it. There's a prettier one. Hang on. Like that one right there. That one. There we go. This one. This one's legit, man. That's a Charlie Brown tree if I've ever seen one. Chad, that's a cedar tree. Those are invasive or evasive or whatever. I don't care. I don't care. They're my trees. I like them. They're staying. Okay? They ain't invading my space. I got three boys and two of them are underneath the age of eight. So I don't know anything about space being invaded. My space is always invaded. Okay, listen. Listen, it's starting to rain. We're going to get a little precipitation. Might get a little sideways. Okay. Well, look out. Hang on. We're gonna do this slowly and in an orderly fashion. All right. Come on, cow. MJ, hang on. It's pouring, man. This is awesome. Where'd he go? There he is. All right. This is like, oh, wait a minute. Yep, don't block my lane. Don't block my lane, brother. Don't block my lane. Listen. You got some move. Don't even get me started on you. I had your cousin last night. He's delicious. All right, let's go. June bug. Woo! Woo! Come on, Cal. We gotta get there before they do or we don't get to see them come through the woods. So 
the greatest thing I ever did was call, was cut these paths through the trees. I love them. Because then the cows started walking on them and they kind of maintain them for us. So it's pretty cool. Hang on, let's get down here. Racing zone and here comes pride on the backside. Where's the cubes? Whoop, there they are. I don't want to run over them. Hang on, let's spin around. Woo! Come on, cow. Man, y'all hear that thunder? MJ. What's up, brother? So somebody said they couldn't see Princess's stripes the other day. I'm not calling you out. I'm just helping you see them. Sonny, get your horns out of the way. All right, you can see them on her face. That a girl princess, look at there. And then the ones on her body are a little bit more subtle, but they are present. Man, it is pouring. Taters! Hey, eat up, get big, make steaks. All right. Gotta do a head count here and make sure we got everybody. Honey, there's Honey. Sonny, Bell, Nelly, Bunny, Finn, CJ, Donkey. <laughs> Donkey, he ain't about the rain, man. Now listen, he's under a tree, okay? So before you come at me, I'm sorry if you don't understand that God made these animals tougher than you, okay? They don't need a barn. They don't need shelter. Their hay doesn't need to go in a barn. All right? Take it easy. Like I said, tougher than us. I love it, man. I love it. This is just a good summer rain, man. This feels amazing. MJ, you're going to make me walk all... Quit it. Quit. No. No. No better than that. Taters. What's up, buddy? Hey, if you make the loop, nobody knows there's some over there. Yep. It'll take them 20 minutes to get over there. Walk over that way. There you go. Glory, you're killing me, Smalls. You're killing me. Yeah, we still got a little bit, boys and girls. We still got a little bit. <laughs> Frank just called your bluff. Easy. Hey, now don't be, don't, don't start doing what MJ does. I'm kind of in the ring of fire right now. That's what I call it. What are you guys doing? Don't do that. Don't sneak up on me. Don't sneak up on me. I'm in the middle of all of them right now. It's probably not wise. Nah, nah, nah. Beans! What's up, buddy? I didn't mean to scare you. I just didn't want to get stabbed. I'm sure you understand already not having horns. CJ. Man, I don't know how big you gotta be to have twins. <laughs> the only thing though is, and you'd have to look back, but Fiona was bigger than Glory. She really was, way bigger. 
So we'll see what happens. We shall see what happens. Yeah, I didn't expect that. I really thought we'd have a baby by glory into May. Was not expecting to be wondering what's going on mid-August. Like many of you that watch us and you've had cattle and you know cattle and some of you even have commented and you know longhorns better than I do. Like 20, 30 years worth of longhorns. She does not look ready. She doesn't look like Tipsy did. She don't look like Fiona did. She doesn't look like Bunny did. She looks like a 12 year old cow that's bred, but not ready to birth. Like she's just, she's, you know, it's interesting because you see things happen. You know, you like, you see her tail move to the side. You see her belly drop. You see her stagger when she gets up. Well, they're just like us. If they lay down for a couple hours and they stand up, their foot's asleep. They're going to wobble a little bit. You know what I'm saying? It is what it is. But no reason to get too excited yet, but I am excited about this weather. Like big time excited, man. I am so over the heat and I'm just going to get worse and worse the older I get. But what's crazy is this summer honestly hasn't been that bad. Two years ago, the year Ray and I got married, like in July, it was crazy. It was like 110 and 116. The feels like was like a 118, 120 for like 16 days. And Ray and I went off to Vegas and got married. And it was cooler in Vegas, like way cooler. So I know for the rest of my life, I'm gonna be in this area. I'm gonna be here, God willing, right? But this summer actually hasn't been that bad. After we have four or five days of heat, we get a little bit of rain. We've been very, very blessed. If uh, I had grass in my pastures, it'd be growing. But we're working on it. We're working on it. So hang on a minute. Wait till that's Franklin. No, you don't want any potatoes? Uh, you just want... <coughs> Yeah, 
Yep. So just beef, huh? Yep. Hey, that's hot. Okay. It's not? No. You're crazy. Look at this. I know, you're making me wait. Mmm. Mmm. Wait until that's frank, it'll be even better. All right, let's get a bowl. Hey, guess what? Mm. Guess what Cujo sent us? What? Some boots and shoes like Grandpa and Uncle Kyle wear. Because we've been mowing and weed eating. Crocs. In yeah. our Crocs <laughs> flip-flops. Yeah. Oh, they sent some shorts, too. Check these, these out. Have my butt look. Looks great. Does it look good? Mm-hmm. Sweet, man. And check this out, look, see, I mean, we got big hands, right? Mm -hmm. Wait, don't do that, then people will know how big you are. But look. Nice. You know how many pairs of pants my hand won't go Those in? Those are deep, too, yeah. I know, but like, I mean, how you go buy a pair of 38, 34 jeans, and then your own hand doesn't fit in the pocket? I don't know, I don't wear jeans. <laughs> check these out, man. Look at that. That's, that's, that's grandpa right there, man. That's what grandpa wears. The mowing landscape lawn king. I got them in a 13, so you can either wear them or grow into them. Yeah. But look at these. These might be a little more your speed. Did you just smell the shoe, grandpa? No. You did. No, I literally did No, not. you smelled I it. like this. I you smelled it. You thought about licking it. Yeah, Those are actually pretty legit. You want me to smell this one now? Yes. Smell that rubber. <laughs> yeah, that proves I didn't smell the other one. Look at that. Nice. Yep. Got a hat. There's another hat, I think. Oh, right there. Look at that. I think they used Grandpa for that silhouette. No, he's got a hat on. It can't be Grandpa. He don't wear hats. Pretty cool. Nice. Yep. I worked with these guys way back when we first started the channel. Mm -hmm. And Uncle Kyle and Grandpa still wear their stuff, so you wanna slip one on? Oh, <laughs> the meat's The meat's really hot, so just hang on a second, okay? Meat! 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 People are worried of what he's gonna do when we eat Frank. Yeah. Put oh, that, you uh, are your feet clean? Yeah. Dude. What? Dude. Okay, we'll put the boot on. Take the thing out, though. You gonna film me putting my shoes on? Yep. Okay. This guy. One of these things, man. There we go. How's that feel? Wow. It'd be new boot goofing. Wow. <laughs> How they feel though, man? The boots feel. The boots better. feel really good? Yeah. Better than the ones I bought you? Yeah. Goodness, man. Those are legit. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, you know where the weed eater's at. Yeah. <laughs> Get to it. What you do is you wear the boot on the left foot, the shoe on the right yeah, foot, and then you're ready for anything. I got it. Yep. If you come across a flood, you hop on your left foot. When it's time to weed eat, you jump on your right foot. All right. Woo! Huge thanks to Cujo. We'll show more on those shoes on the DOS Outdoors channel when we mow with the proper safety footwear, at least. I can't promise I'm going to wear eyewear and all that stuff. That's just me. Oh, yeah. See you, Phil. Is it hot? Stick your finger in it. I'm not going to do it. You do it. That's a dad thing. Yeah, I oh, it's plenty. How's that beef? Can you try it? Yep. That's one of the Burger Bros from last year. Remember those guys? Bacon and spinach. How is it? How is it? Me! 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 <laughs> People are going to think I taught him to do that. Uh, join Adler and eat. Ray and Carter aren't here, so we're going to try and eat it all before they get home. Mm. That's how it usually goes. Actually, this is the second roast we've made. It's called, we're going to call it Rainy Day Roast, even though it's like 
crazy sunny outside yeah, right now. Rain this morning. But there's oh. rain coming, and anytime you can make a roast, you should make yeah, a roast. Yeah, because it rained while we were upstairs. That's right. All right, with that said, y'all be good. It's not the camera. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> That's why you don't work too hard. Yeah. Don't make it weird. God bless. God bless. Deuces. 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 Deuces.